Am I allowed to cut the chip off of my credit card and attach it inside of a magician's wand so I can tap it to magically complete purchases? Unfortunately, the antenna for the tap functionality is actually not just the chip but multiple lines of wire around the edge of your card. So, legally, I have no idea, functionally, it wouldn't work. Us magicians are used to working with wires I mean what wire? A friend of mine did this with his bus pass card. He dissolved the card in high percentage acetone, took a couple days. The chip was left and worked fine. He put the chip at the end of a Harry Potter wand and ran the leads down the side. He gets on the bus and says something like public as transitus, and taps the wand which makes a fun sound. People are amazed every time. Another person in my town did the same thing but instead of a wand he had an incision made in his hand and had it installed there. He's a body mod dude, so this wasn't the weirdest thing he's done. He just waves his hand and it works, it's also great cuz he kinda looks like Gandalf anyway. This is Portland right? Seattle. Ah yes, sci-fi Portland. If you use acetone to dissolve the card you might be able to extract the antenna successfully. Be aware that the antenna on cards is usually extremely fragile when not protected by a slab of plastic. I did this with a transit card twice, reshaping the antenna so that it would slide into a glove, and neither attempt survived more than a day. Metro Presto It's not illegal but prepare for idiots to call the police on you. Someone extracted the NFC chip from their train card here in the UK and stuck it inside a Doctor Who sonic screwdriver toy. Someone witnessed him tap it at the turnstiles while pressing the button to make it light up and make the noise, and phoned the police on him for, hacking the system.